Uh, this model kit review is of the German Panther tank. It is a 135th scale model uh, by Tamiya. And uh, we've got some nice box art here. Uh, don't really have any other details there. And let's have a look inside. And this really looks like typical Tamiya quality. Let's get all these things out here. Okay, so first of all here we have our tank base, the shell, and uh, we end up removing all that. Don't really like that. And uh, <clears throat> looks like we have our axles molded in, and uh, that's on both sides. It's fairly well molded. Here we have the top of the tank, and uh, it has some nice uh, detail molded. It's really just a sort of rough textured surface. And uh, some nice detail here. Very crisp and clean. Let's have a look at our sprues here. So here is the uh, top of the turret. And uh, some nice uh, texture details there. Uh, here's the uh, front for the main gun. The bottom of the turret here. Here is our main gun with some nice detail and uh, maybe our exhaust, we'll have to look and see what that's for. Here we do have our guns, these are our uh, machine guns and then some parts for the side of the uh, tank there. This looks like this is going to be uh, our uh, little hatch. Now we have uh, some steel cables there and uh, some extra tracks some more parts here for the uh, main uh, hull we've got a tank uh, gunner or commander another one there and just lots of little details everywhere uh, molding quality on this sprue is probably not quite as good do so you have some mold lines in some of these pieces as you can see over there but overall not bad fuel tanks over here and then we've got a full one here just of the uh, wheels and sprockets very nicely molded with a good level of detail and then these are for the wheels so that they'll be able to turn this is pretty flexible and these are going to be um, holding the wheels on I do like the way that uh, Tamiya does their wheels so that it does turn. Here are our decals, not many really decals for a tank. And then uh, here are the uh, tracks, nicely molded, soft, flexible, and uh, looks like these are going to go in. Uh, maybe like that. I have to line them all up to get them in and then you're going to melt them from the outside this time uh, normally they're melted from the inside but it'll go in like that okay let's have a look at our instructions so here are some details about the tank here and uh, let's have a look inside here we've got parts listings right there and uh, we start off with the uh, main body the shell, wheels are going on and uh, then we move to our uh, main gun and our hatch and we build the uh, turret and we put our guys in there And then we uh, add some details here for the uh, turret and extra details here for our um, tools that go on the side of the tank and then uh, that's how you put the, uh, the figure in there, the driver 
and then uh, the machine guns, and then the extra all of the uh, extra track, and then all the extra utilities that they uh, tools that they uh, bring with them, and then uh, that all gets mounted on the uh, top of the main hull, and you put those parts together. Put our tracks together, and then that's the painting and decal guide. So overall, this is another really good quality uh, tank model from Tamiya.